all right guys so this is the ROS 13.1 release for Redmi Note 10 Pro as you can see that and I have been using from couple of days right now and I will be giving its full and final review of this room so if you are new to this channel and watch its content regarding to this you must watch this video until the last and then decide to subscribe or not so let's get started to the video so guys first of all I would like to talk about the smoothness of this room now I have set it up to 120 Hertz and as you can see that the smoothness of this room is too good the app loading and closing of any application is too faster as you can see that there is no lag in the jitter in any QS panel while scrolling the device you can also see there is no issues with the smoothness of this custom room. Now talking about the customizations we all know that ROS doesn't provide much of the customizations in their devices but for the video purpose I would like to talk about like you can see that there is a gesture software few of the customizations they have added not much of the customization they have been added so far so you all know that is we are not getting any sort of customizations now talking about that let's talk about the benchmark that i have took in this device and how it does perform so this is the and to do benchmark application that i have took so far and you can surprise to see that here you got the 336 33486 scores which is too good the back in it is a time of summer and you can see that 0.5 degree celsius is up and temperature and 3 degree sorry 3 percent battery fall is there so that is okay i can say better than average scores that we are getting now i also took many others results that you can see for, from here so this is the uh, time when I put my char uh, ch uh, device on the charging and I can tell you that the 33 watt charging is also working fine. Now this is the L1 le security level and as you can see that L1 security level is working fine in this device so you will not get any issues with the Amazon Prime and Netflix options. Safety net does pass so we are good to go and guys if you are really enjoying this video then please give a thumbs up to this video. And this is just what do you say? latest CPU throttle app test and you can see that I have took without any performance profile and we got CPU throttle 90% to max max performance with 149.638 GIPS and now again I took for 15 minutes with the th thermal profiles enabled and we get lesser CPU scores so that's why I didn't like that and already talked about this one and now if I talk about uh, the files application gets a new look as you can see that is full monet support over the files application and the whole UI and look has been changed so far. So this is the new option that you can face. There is no any changes, much changes, but yeah, you can see that the full monet support of the dialer, SMSs, apps and everything play store is going to change. So you can see that that is working fine with the latest updates. Now if I talk about what do you say? the settings option now talking about the wi-fi internet settings i haven't faced any issues the call quality call reception is too good no issues that we're going to find in there the wi-fi calling is also working fine the in applications you are getting the parallel space i also created the parallel youtube application and you can see that that is working fine as you can see that now if i generally talk about another ones like uh, notification you can enable everything from here the battery is there so yeah battery percentage option is working as you can see that i can enable the battery percentage from here and disable it so that is this is my battery uses and i can say that the battery uses are good i generally get eight hours of sot on this device so the charging is uh, too good fast charging is supported and the battery backup is also good in consideration to other custom rooms now talking about the sound and vibration there is a me sound enhancer is also been given and haptic feedback intensity option is given but there is not feature supported because my device in silent mode if you enable it to vibration mode and then you can also see that it is not working so there is an issue with that also this is a wallpaper style you can customization whole thing from here in the security version you get the fingerprint only support is there no face unlock is there like pixel devices in the systems you get the gestures options so far and in the gestures as usual settings is there nothing has been changed so far you get the updater over here you can dirty flash this custom room via twrp but in my recommendation never do a dirty flash because dirty flash can kill your what is a full ui smooth ui performance this is thermal profile as usual not working from many what do you say months or a year that it is not working after android 13 so this is the about phone section if i go through the about phone section you with the latest what do you say 
एंड्रॉयड थर्टीन पॉइंट वन वर्जन और एर ओ एस थर्टीन पॉइंट वन वर्जन एज यू कैन सी दैट एंड द डिवाइस नेम इज मैंशन वी गेट द लेटेस्ट अप्रैल फिफ्थ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री अपडेट एंड पफ कॉर्नल इज बींग यूज ओवर दियर विच इज यूज इन यूर डिवाइस इफ आई एफ आई आस्क यू इफ समन आस्क मी अबाउट द डिवाइस सर्टिफिकेशन द डिवाइस सर्टिफिकेशन इज ऑल्सो डज पास सो नो इशूज विद द डिवाइस सर्टिफिकेशन एज यू कैन सी देयर सो दिस टाइम आई कैन हाईली रिकमेंड दिस कस्टम रोम ओवर पिक्सल एक्सपीरियंस एंड चेरिस ओ एस फोर डॉट सेवन दैट यू कैन यूज दिस रोम विद इफ यू हैव लवर ऑफ वट यू से कस्टमाइजेशन डोंट गॉन यूज दैट बट यू कैन गेट अ बेटर एंड मच मोर गुड स्टेबिलिटी इन दिस कस्टम रोम सो फॉर द बैंकिंग एप्स यू कैन ऑल्सो यूज दैट सो दिस इन दिस video i can highly recommend this custom room so if you really did enjoy watching this video give a thumbs up to the video and also subscribe to the channel for more sake of content in the future so my name is arab i'll be on a media in the next video till then 